welcome to another tutorial of the WinCCTA portal. In today's tutorial we will see how we can make a simple faceplate for pump setup. Let's start first we will make a simple pump on off logic in the PLC. Now we will drop the items on the HMI which will be included in our faceplate. We can drag and drop one pump on the screen. When we click on this pump faceplate will appear on screen. Now select all elements for faceplate and click create faceplate option. All elements in the faceplate are listed in this column and we can configure the required properties in the right side column. Now we will make an exit button for the faceplate. As you can see that newly created button added in the list. Now in this area we'll select the required functions for elements included in the faceplate. First we will create a tag with name visible. We will use this tag to show and hide the faceplate. Now we will drag and drop process tag for buttons and pilot LED in the faceplate properties menu. We can change the name of the property. One thing to remember here is that process tag for LED and buttons is for indication or illumination only.
We can include text property of the text field to put different text for each instance of this faceplate. Now we will use the visible tag to show and hide all of the elements included in the faceplate by using animation visibility. Now we will go to the event menu and select the required events for the push buttons. Now finally faceplate is ready, we can release it. We will delete this faceplate and insert the latest version on the screen. If we open the properties of the faceplate we can find the properties which we have included while creating the faceplate. We will link the properties with PLC and HMI tags. We can put text which will be displayed on the faceplate. For the visible property we'll create new HMI tag with show faceplate. 
When this tag is zero faceplate will stay hidden. When this tag is one faceplate will pop up. Now from event menu we can connect the PLC and HMI bits to the switches on the faceplate. Faceplate property settings are done now. Now we want to open the faceplate when somebody click on this pump icon. To do this we have to set the bit show faceplate. When someone click on this pump icon. We can set the appearance of the pump to change its color from yellow to red when turned on and off. We are ready to test faceplate. We will simulate HMR and PLC and go online. As you can see that when I click pump faceplate pop up. You can see that everything is working fine with faceplate. Start button is starting the pump and stop button stops the pump. Pilot LED also turns green when pump is on. So this how faceplate works. Please subscribe my channel if you like this video. Till next video take care and goodbye.